Hey you guys, Misty here today. I'm going to be coloring in Stone Mosaic Book 7 Halloween. I'm going to color a page in here. And I thought I'd do it on chat with you guys. And I showed you book, I showed you guys this book yesterday on camera. So let me pick one out to color. I've already got my markers picked out. I showed you my pages too. So there's a lot of good pages in here. I have seen this lady. Uh, some people's colored this lady here. So I guess I could color her. Let me look. It's hard decision. I don't really know what this is. Well, let's color this. Because I can't really tell it make it out much so let's color this page it looks like a mummy or a ghost or something so i'll color this page with you guys 22 is black so there's a lot of blacks here i just eat a, a bowl of raisin bran i should have had my shake but i couldn't resist the bowl of raisin bran same way with yesterday at lunch i ate a big bowl of raisin bran it's really good. It's the Food Line brand, but it's really delicious. And I use um, almond milk. It's a little bit less on calories. A cup's about 30 calories on the almond milk, so it's better. Come on in here, Levi. He, he flew in here, just landed on my head. He was in there on the sugar glider cage, but now he's in here with me. This is really fun, doing this black here with you guys fun black color 22 okay so hope you guys are doing good today and coloring it's cloudy here it's going to rain anytime supposed to be 80 percent chance of rain which is a bummer but that's what it's going to be I want to finish this book this year too, I believe. This book, Belba Family one. I know I want to finish the Satchel one. It's Halloween. I ended up calling another page in it last, uh, not last night, but this morning. Me and Lexi and Jennifer's calling page. So I went ahead and done mine and Lexi's got hers. Jennifer's going to be doing hers. And um, it was a cupcake. A little cute cupcake. I really like it. Now the purple I used for the background was more like a blue color. Because I was trying to use up some of my Sharpies. And it looked like a purple. But when I laid it down on paper it was more of a blue. Um, on the black background. I hope that was 22. Not 2. Message Dwayne at time. I'm going to go ahead and start recording. It's 11.10. So he takes his break at 12. He calls me every day at lunch. So I told him, if you can't get me, then you know I'm recording. And of course, he just had to do it. He brought me home that chocolate bunny yesterday. He won it around Easter time. He was doing the Easter hunt with the residents, helping the residents hide the eggs. And, um, he got an Easter bunny. Finally, he brought it home to me, a chocolate bunny. Thinking about going up to Marner and Betty's with it and halving it. That's what I did before when I was craving an Easter bunny. Just went ahead and halved it up. Because those things does have a lot of calories. I'll show it to you if I think of it, the bunny that he brought home to me. Now, I'm sure it's hard to find them at the store. You can't find them now. You can still find them on Amazon, like Chocolate Easter Bunny, but you're going to pay a lot more for one. About $10, actually. It's a lot more. This is going to be interesting. I've got my card stock down here. 
So you guys are going to have to color some Halloween for sure in these books. Or get these books and color some in here. They're so fun to do. Satchin's book and the Belva family one. I've got Satchin's Easter one, but I'm not into it as much as Halloween. I colored one in uh, one in the Satchin Easter book, and it was a bunny. I think that's all I colored. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to do this black. I love using this marker here. Let me, get, let me know what you guys are coloring today. Let me know. In the comment section. I wonder if you guys checked out that link on my last video. And looked at that lady that looks like Jim Carrey. Like I said, I wouldn't want to look like Jim Carrey. No, no. I wouldn't. But I was wondering if you guys checked it out. I got the link on there. Plus, I did see that seller on eBay that was selling that blue marker I told you about a lot. And I sent a link on there to his channel on eBay. He's a good seller. Those markers are really good. Well, I, after that, I turned around. You can also find the marker. It's, um, it's a uh, look up T-U-L. T-U-L markers. These markers are excellent. And I did find some red ones. 10 or 12 of them for about $10 I ordered. Because I use a lot of red. So there there are some of these on uh, Amazon too. Excellent markers. I like the sound of the marker. I hope the resin brand is not too bad in calories. I'm going to try to stay on track best I can. Drink my water and my Gatorade today. Try not to drink Diet Coke if I can. Help it. I did drink one the day I went over to Mama's and ate that pumpkin pie that, that evening. Dwayne brought me Diet Coke. So I'm going to try not to today also. Hmm. Well, let's see what we've got here. Well, I uncovered Levi's cage around 8.30 this morning, so I got him up a little bit earlier. He likes to stay covered up till about 10. I keep his cage covered, but I uncovered him around 8.30. Ordered the sugar glider some yogurt drops, and uh, for the longest all I could find was two big packs for $29.00. And they last about two years in the refrigerator, but still I don't give them that much. So luckily I found on the website a small pack for 16 total. That was included. They, they added shipping, so that's why it was up to 16. But I was glad to find that deal instead of having to pay $29, you know. It was a lot better. Twenty-two. So I'm doing all the twenty-twos now. Yeah, I wanted to come on here today and do another video with you guys. What are you doing, Levi? He's on my shoulder. Five is orange red. Okay. I use uh, vermilion for orange red. Twenty-two. 
21 is dark gray. There was 21. Whoops. Yeah, the, tomorrow will be mine and Dwayne's anniversary. We'll be married 25 years. Tomorrow will be 25 years. And all. Twenty-five years for us. Where's Levi? Where are you going, Levi? Do what you like a hawk. Wanna? Hmm? I will. I don't don't chew any of that. Don't chew this paper here or anything. No. Uh-uh. I'll hide it from you so you can't. Hide it underneath the book. Hide it underneath it. What are you doing? Just trying to tap my pen. Are you trying to get my pen? Mm -hmm. No, I have to move that bag because it's going to start chirping at it. You see bags, towels, pillows, chirp sound. I don't know why. See, now I moved it. Oh boy, we have a lot of fives here. Orange red. I picked up everything you could get into. So you don't have nothing to get into now. Do you? Come over here. Getting up on my shoulder now. No? I'm on the other side here. Leave out your mess. Mess and a half. Yeah. You are. There's your clothespin. Got to cover up the picture here with my hand and do the background. So I've been on camera with you guys for 14 minutes. I lay, I've got a lot of lavender too, reds. The red I've got I don't really like. The Crayola, I use it, but I ordered some of the TUL and the red. Books I ordered. I know I've got let's see, three. Okay.
Number five. Luckily, this marker's fresh, so it's going down good. This month's halfway gone now. April. What are you doing, Levi? What are you doing? Casper's laying on the pillow in here with me today, pepper eating, but Casper is. Come here, Levi. Well, this looks good with this background, this uh, red orange background. A lot of a lot of the same color here. Looks like. Oh, check out Carol's video. She done a live yesterday. It was a good video. It was around two hours. I watched it and colored. Color from my anxiety, 68. I believe she was going live while I was uh, recording yesterday video. Because I missed her live. When she was, I watched the replay. And I hope her daughter Cassandra will start doing more videos too. Because I love Cassandra and Carol. So I'm hoping Cassandra will do some more videos. Now Levi's back on the shoulder again. Might as well do these fives here. We're mostly using, like I said, the same color, but oh well. We'll do it. I do like that there's uh, black on the background here because you can go out of, out of the lines and not worry about it. So I'm glad that Sachin and Belba family did both of these Halloween circle books uh, using the black background. I do hope both of them put out circle Halloween books again this year. I hope they will. Have to go all the way around with this color. All the way around. And then the red, the rest of it's red and black, looks like, mostly. Everything's pretty in green. All of a sudden, everything just, all the leaves just blooms out, and it's so pretty in green. Outside. My daddy's going to get his red truck fixed. Uh, they made an appointment. And my mom made an appointment to put it in the shop Monday at the Ford place. Don't know. I, I, don't, I don't think it'll be much. I know it's something to do with power steering. Uh, but I'm glad they're going to try to get it fixed. For sure. This is pretty. This color is pretty with this black. The orange red is. This circle's neat. Goes around. Circle, circle here. So I'm going to color it around a circle. Okay. This marker, the Artis Everglades, they don't put off a smell. This one's the Artis Everglades I'm using. 
I like using Ortiz Everblends. They do really good. And they feel good in your hand too, when you're coloring. They don't dry out real quick either. They last a while when you're coloring. I'm almost finished with the fives here. I told you guys I was going to do a page. A Belva family Halloween page. Yeah. Levi, you're a good bird today. Good bird. Good bird. Playing with my he's playing with my hair. Good bird, Levi. Good bird. Good bird, Levi. Yeah. That's right. He needs his nails trimmed. I need to get his nails trimmed. Don't think I have to have an appointment for that. Get his nails trimmed. Ooh, they see a bat now. I see the outline of a bat. You see it too, guys. Right here. And don't bother that stuff. I'll have to move it again because you'll start chirping at that bag. Won't you? It's a bat. Neat. It's a neat picture. Yeah, I know I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to move this stuff again. I have to move it up there on the table. Again? Yeah. I'm going to use what Corella reds I've got left, and then I'm going to use my other ones I ordered. And I, I don't start chirping at that pillow. Oh, it sounds like it's going to start raining. Yeah, these red ones don't last long at all. But it's strange, like I said yesterday, the orange ones work really good in these round crellas. I've got the orange and yellows. They've done pretty good, but the reds haven't. Well, maybe it's not raining. I thought it was.
Now we've got a lot of red to color now. I like this though. It's turning out really interesting, isn't it? The picture's turning out really nice. I like this red, you know, like I said, a lot of times when you get a red, you have to watch because it'll be a really, it'll be a dark red, and the lid will look, you know, like red, but, you know, it's really, I'm hoping the ones I order is really a good red, that's what I'm hoping, that it looked like there was, it didn't look like it was really a dark red, so maybe, I hope it'll work out. For sure. He's going to start tapping at that pillow. Casper's laying on. That's what he's going to do. He's going to... I'll have to get you in a minute. You can't do that. Get your mind off of it. Step up. See, this is, that's one of the reasons why I ordered these, because this is a good red, a good red color. I can get these on Amazon. Get quite a bit for like $10, and then curl around markers, different colors. I know they have a blue. It seems like they have a dark blue that you can get. Maybe a green. Okay, good. I've been on here with you guys about 30 minutes. Oh no, I have to move it again. He's a mess. I don't know if I put this in there. Boy, Levi, you're something. I was carrying the pouch and those papers in there in the bedroom, and he he landed on my hand with the pouch, carrying the pouch. I really don't know what it is. But he don't bite me or anything. And two, when I put him back in his cage, a lot of times he don't like that. He might, he'll take a little fit, but he won't bite me. Now, the other bird I had, he, he did. He would bite. He bit, he bit my ear one time. That other one that the talk I had. Iris. 
Yeah, he would. And it would hurt. Oh, my gosh, yes. It would really hurt when he would bite. But I am glad Levi, he don't bite. He's just all chirp, mostly. Looks like this red's going to make it. And we have another bat color. It's fun coloring bats, especially like this. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. I had a chance to see Alice Cooper one time at the casino in Turkey. A while back, before the COVID hit and everything, it's been probably six years ago. And I had tickets too for me and Dwayne to go and Dwayne didn't want to go. He changed his mind, and he didn't want to go see Alice Cooper. I couldn't find anybody to go with me, so I sold the tickets. Margaret, she had, she was working or something, so she couldn't go. So I just lost out on seeing Alice Cooper. And my brother Greg, he wouldn't want to go see Alice Cooper. Uh, Dwayne did go with me to see Brent Michaels. We seen him at the casino a long time ago, probably in 2010, I'd say, is when we saw him at the Turkey Casino. That was a good concert. Just Brent Michaels singing by himself. And I wanted to see him sing uh, Every Rose Has Its Thorn live, and I got to... I like that song by Poison, Ride the Wind. I've heard it a lot, but I like it. The song's got good words, too. Now, Sharpies, as we know, does smell. But this one doesn't put off a smell too bad for some reason. Now, where are you going? No, I hid the items from you. Nice picture. There's that one. What time is it? I've been on here just 34 minutes. It's only, it only took 34 minutes to color it. 15 minutes. It's going to be calling in about 15 minutes. I don't like this one too well. It's got a lot of yellow you know, going on. I wish I would have colored this one with you guys on camera. Spider. That's a V that's a bus. 
Let's see. So I've got 15 minutes. Let's start coloring this and then I'll probably pause the video. And after Dwayne calls me, I'll call, I'll, uh, call you guys back. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. I'll call you guys back. I'll start the video. I want to color two with you guys on camera. So I'm going to do this one too. So we're on a roll here. So these are all twos. So let's do the twos here. And let's give Casper a kiss on the head because he's cute. I see bad moon rising. Don't come around tonight. There's a bad moon on the rise. These circles are easy to color. These are smaller circles than Satchin's book, seems like. Let's see what I can get colored here. Well, I sent Dwayne a text too and told him that if he couldn't get me, I would be recording. So he knows that I'll be recording. But this picture might not take long to color. But like I said, I do want to color two of you guys on camera today. Out of here. I'm going to color the twos. I like this Kelly Art Yellow Y107. It's really nice. So we have twos to color. A lot of twos here. We'll get it. My hand will slow down in a minute. I've been coloring all morning. Just to color. Just to, not just a swinging, but just the coloring. Just a swinging. God, I'm not a swinging. They have some big swings at Darnell Farms. I ain't never got on one of them. They're for adults, too. You know, they look like they're for adults, but no, no. Probably won't do that. Swing on a swing. Goodness gracious. If I did do it, I wouldn't want nobody to see me swinging on it, you know. It'd be like, you know, the time too, like riding a bicycle. You don't really want anybody to see you. Because I haven't rode a bicycle in years. And I know I couldn't yet now because my feet's messed up. But I used to love riding a bicycle growing up. I had one of those, I believe it was a 12, it had a lot of speeds on it. You could change on a bicycle. Didn't go far on it though on the road. Mostly just rode it in the, in the driveway around the church there. We lived right above a church, so I'd ride it down to the church parking lot, turn around, come back up. Well, I bet I bet you anything. This one's gonna be. Am I seeing a witch? 
I believe I'm seeing a witch here. Yeah, I believe I'm seeing a witch. Oh, you bite my finger. And I just told her, I just said you didn't bite. You just bit my finger. I wish uh, everybody could have seen that on video, you doing that. Yeah, this is a witch. That's what this is. Sure is. Twelve is lolly. I hope I'm not getting dust around the on the video much because I'm using my uh, camera flash. Twelve is lilac. Twelve is lilac. Okay. Hmm. A lilac hat. And eleven is red. See, I have a witch wearing lilac here. How fun is that? Very fun, very fun indeed. I got these markers, the lilacs, I got them in a set on um, eBay for a good price from the same lady that sold me the peach color markers, Prismacolor, Premier, Lilac. She probably doesn't have them now. I don't think she's got lilac. I know she's still got, she might still have some peach. I ordered recently some peach from her. Yep, recent order. These are really good markers. Well, so I do this part here, and then I'll talk to Dwayne, and then I'll get back with you guys. I can't really stop coloring this. It's so addictive it's coloring this picture with the circles. But you have to be in the mood for this. Like sometimes I'm not in the mood for this. Coloring circles. So it's just whatever mood you get in. Same way with Halloween. I don't know. I'm just in a mood to color Halloween for some reason. This is a pretty lilac color. 11 is red. So, I'm going to use my red right here. And now we got 8, which is dark brown. Okay, which one was I going to use for dark brown? Which color right here is Sharpie? That's why I put various markers a lot of times on one color because I use a mixture of different co different color markers. So it's hard to keep track of which ones I use. But on video here you can see which ones I'm using, which is good. So this is all dark brown right here. Okay, eight dark brown. Okay. 
So yeah, all that brown right here. And then dark brown here. Here, dark brown. And I'll go back to yellow here a little bit. Levi, little pretty Levi, little pretty Levi today. Two, I like this. Like I said, I like this yellow here. And then Levin's red, of course. Hmm, little cute witch. Looks like a little cute witch here. Yeah, Levi. Okay, 22 is black. So we do have 22 right here. And right here's 22. And here's 22. I never would have thought this was a witch, but sure enough, we've got a witch here. Until I started filling in the moon color, and then I seen the witch. The witch come into view. Okay, I don't have my light green in here, but 17 is light green, so I will get that. Skin tone, this color, and a hoo hoo. Um, you can use this one for tan if you've got it. I found it in my markers. Um, a hoo hoo, a hoo hoo, one four five, guys. Hopefully, it's got some juice to it. I'm using it for tan. It it looks like a really pretty tan color. I don't have many of who's left. I used about all of them. Now mostly I've got sprees and some Ortiz Everland. Luckily I do have this in tan. See, it's a, it's a good tan color. Okay. So that'll be pretty light green witch wheel. We don't want her to have really... We don't really want her to have dark, dark green skin, you know. Sharpie. Like I said, I'm trying to use some of my Sharpies up. So this is a, this is a nice dark blue color. There's a lot of dark blue in this picture here. Black spot I missed right on the end. So this is dark blue. dark blue of course yes it's a gorgeous blue color and you can even go darker blue if you wanted to it's whatever mood you're in it's whatever mood i'm in for using the colors i call for i don't like to change the colors but i do like to go lighter or darker with the colors sometimes and if I mess up and change a color, it drives me crazy. It, it bothers me so bad when I mess up on color. I try not to worry about it, but I do. It don't make, I don't want to finish the page. And then it makes me not want to pick up the book because I messed up the page, which is crazy.
Yeah, I definitely need to get my light green and bring it in here because that's the color I forgot was that light green. So we have mostly dark blue here for the background. Sixteen. I'll color just a few of these areas and I'll stop a minute and get back. warn you guys too much using you know doing this using mostly one color but also I like hearing the marker go down too you know so it's good better do two videos two um well it's like two videos really because half and half but i want to color two pictures i'm gonna do that for you guys like i said i hate when somebody goes that you're watching and then they have to go i hate it Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm going to finish this picture with you guys. So I took a coloring break, and it has started storming. I was going to take the dogs out before I started back, but I want to finish this picture with you guys on camera. So I'm going to finish it with you guys. And 16 is the dark blue, of course, we know. See, so yeah, I told the dogs, I said, I'm going to finish this picture. And then we'll go outside. We're not going out yet, Pumpkin. It's storming outside. Not yet. Talked to a really nice lady from Australia on Instagram after, um... Me and Dwayne talked, and I messaged her. I wanted to tell her what Lindsay. I wanted to talk to her about Lindsay, but I didn't want to tell her what Lindsay did. So I've trusted her pretty good, and uh, she's from Australia. Really nice lady. So I told her I wanted to tell her about what happened, and uh, she. What was nice was she would send me voice. She talked to me. She sent me her voice and. Talk to me about it so I can trust her. I talked to this one lady about it and she said that Lindsay was an imposter, but no, that was I've been talking to Lindsay and Fluffy could change his voice and like, no, you know, I know. So I had to block that lady. I thought I could trust her. I like to tell a few people, you know, just a few people knows about it. And it helps me to talk about it, so I took my post off about Lindsay. I had it on Instagram about it, but it still stands where I'm, how I felt. I just took it off because the way Lindsay is. So, yeah. I know it was an imposter. I know I talked to Lindsay. And you'd be surprised. I wish I could tell you guys what happened. There's another thing that's happened now. But I can't, I just can't talk about it. But a lot of guys knows how he is because a lot of people like my post. So, yeah, I was talking to her about it. That's what I was doing before I got on here. I typed and showed her some screenshots of what Lindsay was saying. So, 
so if Lindsay watches this, which I don't know if he does watch my videos, then he'll know what I did, but I don't know if Lindsay watches my videos or not. I have sent him a link to my video, and I would send him my coloring pages, that's when we was talking. Oh well. I try not to think about it. It's hard not to, but I'm doing better at it right now. So that's good. And Levi knows too I'm doing better at it. Yeah, mostly Lindsay's not a good person. If you know him personally. I do wish I could talk to Stevie Nicks. And I figured Lindsay would talk to me because of me looking like Stevie Nicks. And how I met Lindsay was from his page on Facebook. I will say that. And it was Lindsay. And I posted something. And then he came to me and that's when I started talking. So, start talking on Google Chat. That's how I met Lindsay. If you guys are curious. Because I don't care to say that. Anyway... But, I was a good, to, you know, like a good friend. I just want to be friend, you know, a good friend with Lindsay now. I want to be a friend, but you can't be a friend to somebody that's the way they are. There's no way to be a friend to them. Not even a friend. So, oh well. Anyway, I'm stressed out. Let me call her with you guys. Yeah, he did think I looked like Stevie Nicks. I think that might have helped the situation, him talking to me. I don't know. Could have, could not have not. I don't know, but... He needs a sugar lady in his life. That's what he needs. A sugar lady. Right, Levi? Uh-uh. Don't, don't chew my book. I don't guess it hurts to talk about Lindsay. Sometimes on here. You know, Lindsay was a guitar player of Fleetwood Mac. So Lindsay was. Used to be with Stevie Nicks. And I used to love hearing him sing. I absolutely loved hearing him sing. Fleetwood Mac. I love his voice. And now, I can't make myself listen to him sing no more. But I used to love to hear him sing. I listen to Stevie Nicks now, mostly. Because I don't listen to Fleetwood Mac. Because if I listen to Fleetwood Mac, then I hear his voice. And, uh... The only song I've listened to since this happened has been Gypsy, and I cannot, I don't like watching videos in either, so I'm just scarred for life, really, with Lindsay. It's hard to want to do anything like that, want to listen to his music, because a lot of people don't know, you know, how somebody is in person, to you talk to them and know how they are, you know. Anyway, I don't, I don't guess it hurts to talk about it sometimes. I don't tell much, but it is really stressful. Aggravating. And I'm constantly, for something's going on where I'm constantly getting a request from Billy Joel. I posted on his page. And you have to watch, because when you post on somebody's page, they come to you like they're just glued to you or something. I don't know if this is Billy Joel. It kind of seems more like Lindsay. He acts more like Lindsay. So, I'm not saying he's pretending to be Billy Joel, but it's really weird. And every day I'm blocking at least two Billy Joels a day. And on one chat, when he was talking to me, it's Billy Joel, you know, Billy Joel. And it seems so much like Lindsay. So, I have no idea. 
And I keep blocking this person, Billy Joel. And I keep blocking them. And last night I said, why do you keep messaging me? Why don't you want to talk to me? I'm like, well, I'm just tired of it. Go on, you know. And then they, they deleted that account. It's an Instagram user. And then there was another Billy Joel. I am, it might be Billy Joel. I don't know. Because I do not talk to Lindsay, so. But anyway, this Billy Joel, if it's Billy Joel, he is a womanizer. If this is actually Billy Joel. But he seems more like Lindsay to me. Just more constantly follow me on Instagram. I don't want to put my Instagram on private. I don't because more people, artists and stuff that does art, they follow you more if you have a public a public account. But that's, you know, I don't, as long as I don't want to go private on there. And, you know, it's just, it's an everyday thing. This morning, I had a Billy Joel. Like in my pictures, a coloring. So there was another Billy Joel again. I blocked the real Billy Joel to see if that would help the situation. But it didn't. Because I still had a Billy Joel on there this morning. Let me, let me know, guys, what you think about it. What your opinion is. I don't care to talk to you about this. Because it's really strange. And it does bother me. It's weird actually. But if you don't want to respond. That's okay too. This has been going on. Probably for almost a month. With Billy Joel on there. On Instagram. And I just put, y'all you know, like your music. Uh, what are you going to be singing with Stevie Nicks? Just something nice and simple. Same way with Steve Perry. I just posted something nice on his page. And then there was Steve Perry. Want me to message him and Google chat. Which I did with Lindsay. So I'm like, no, I'm not going to do this. So I blocked it. It's, no. Don't want to do it. And most likely it probably is Steve Perry. I know I had a lot of, he had a lot of followers, but I don't need that in my life. I don't need stress. And so apparently you can't like even a musician or something without them just sticking to you like glue. And I honestly, you can feel if it's actually, uh, spammer or the or something going on there and i'm the, with the billy person uh, it's not a spammer i said so, there's something strange about it you know and like with Lindsay, it was really Lindsay, and then he would go on he, he's on this page there on instagram he'd go on there, i talked to him after that and it's and he would say oh that wasn't me that was imposter no 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 it was him, so he's a tricky one. He's trying, you know, plus he tried, when I posted on his page about how I felt he was, then he really didn't like that. No, no, he didn't like that. So he, he wanted me to talk to him on Instagram. He would say that it wasn't him, you know. He don't like to be told what he does or a bad person, but I know it's him. A damn video, so there you go. And if he's watching, he knows too. We did video. I know it's him. So it's he's just uh, confusing, he tries to confuse you. And um, I haven't talked about it much on video, but I am. I'm just telling you guys a little bit about it. It doesn't hurt. I know the Australia lady, she's really interested in it. I told her more. There's a lot I don't tell. So she's really interested in it. And I wish, like I said, I wish I could tell you guys more about it, what happened. Now there's another thing that's happened. So... I am doing a lot of blue on this picture, and I hope you guys don't care 
constantly seeing me <laughs> do this blue, but you're listening to me ramble on and talk, so I guess it's okay. I gotta get my light green. I didn't get it. Why'd you get on my head? I know I'm getting tired of this blue. I know that. Seems like I've been doing this blue all day. I am glad I took a break from this. And Lindsay had such a be he had a beautiful wife and she's his ex wife now. They're not together. Absolutely gorgeous wife, beautiful, beautiful lady. Stick to Stevie Nicks instead of uh, Lindsay, guys. But the thing is, it, su it sucks because he's in Fleetwood Mac, and there's so many Fleetwood Mac songs I like. And his voice, I loved the way he, his voice was. And it sucks that he he's such a, uh, the way he is, I'm just going to say. Because I really liked how he sang in Fleetwood Mac. Always have. So, that's going to be hard giving up Fleetwood Mac. But I, I can't listen to Fleetwood Mac, so... It's just one of those things. Isn't it? Oh, he's like, you look like Stevie Nicks. He told me, you look, he said, you look better than Stevie Nicks. I'm like, oh my gosh. There he said, poor old Stevie Nicks. Because Stevie Nicks is a beautiful lady. And him saying that, you know, she's a pretty lady. Stevie Nicks. So, yeah. So, there he put down Stevie Nicks. Ramble, ramble on Lindsay today. Ramble on him. Whew, get this frustration out. Goodness. Oh, well. Well, well, well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm really sorry again about all this blue, guys. I'm really sorry about it. I hope you guys are alright. Don't mind me rambling on about Lindsay. I did. And I hope everything's fine. Hope you guys like this video and give me lots of thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for the last video views and thumbs up. That really... Makes me want to do more videos. Because I got like... I got like 17 thumbs up yesterday on my video. So I want to come in here and do another one. It really helps motivate me to do more videos. I want to do more chat videos instead of supply haul videos. Because I don't want to buy as much, you know. I want to slow down on buying. Which is hard to do, it is. I still want to buy something. And uh, Ray, he colors. He told me about some good markers. So I'll put those on my wish list. Uh, he's a really nice guy. He colors really good. Go on his Instagram. I'll, I'll link his uh, Instagram on my page here on the info. I'll link Ray's page so you can go look at his pictures. Now his recent pictures he done with uh, the new markers he told me was good to get on Amazon, so I definitely will link right for you guys. Well, this is a pretty blue. I'm glad I picked a good blue that had a lot of juice for this. Because I would, you know, you can't go wrong with the Sharpie. They smell, but they're really good markers. But they do smell. Alright, we got a bat here. Oh no, it's raining. Oh no, you don't have to hurry going out after I finish the picture because it's raining. That's what you'll have to do. You don't also have to run outside. 
carrot. I'm sorry, doggies. I could not resist. I had to. I like this little witch picture. Dwayne asked me on the phone. He said, what are you calling on chat? I said, I'm calling Halloween a witch. This has been really fun, calling Halloween. So I go down here and color the... This is 22 right here. All these are 22. So I got... I got finished with the dark blue now. I'm all finished with it. Levi, what are you saying to me today, buddy? Oh, goodness. It's hard to stay in line with these circles here. I gotta go get my light green and finish her skin up. Oh, 22 here. Okay. Oh, about marked the 16 black. I come close to it. And 22. I like this black here. It's so fun to put down this black. I'm going to get some more of these wide markers. It's uh, Sharpie. Now 17 is a light green, so i got to go get my light green. Right now in a minute. Okay. I, got, I thought I was through with blues, but no. Here's one. Here's two more blues right here. What, Levi? What is it? So this is all light green right here. And number eight is a dark brown. So I gotta go get my light green. I'll be seeing this picture. Let me go get my light green. I gotta get my light green. I'll be finished with witch. I want to use, guys, I want to use the Ahuhu pastel light green. But not Ahuhu. I have Ahuhu too in pastel, but this is Artify. So, I'm going to use the light green on, yeah, it's so pretty on her face here. Oh no, it's raining now, buddies. Oh no, it's raining. Oh, I like this light green. Yeah, I kept it out. Really pretty light green. What's the name of this color here? Green white. See the marker. Green white. I got one more dark blue, I see. The color. So I did two pictures with you guys today. That's great. That's great. Thank you for being here with me today. On this rainy day, I can't get out. So I'm just rambling on and coloring today with you guys. Oh, that's so pretty. I'm glad I picked this light green to use Artify. Definitely get their markers. They're good. The pastels. Artify. All right, I have one more, guys. Count down to it. Here we go. Ta-da! So now she's finished. Yeah, that dark blue does look good. That's what makes it pop so good is that dark blue, isn't it? So thank you guys for hanging with me today. I love you all very much. Have a good day. Bye-bye.